Shots fired, two people run down by a truck. San Antonio police think that it all happened after migrants were being held against their will. And we broke this story at the end of our six o'clock newscast. Tonight, a witness is sharing what she saw. This was on the city's south side near South Presa and Graff Road. The night team's John Paul Barajas has been following this story for us tonight. John Paul, police say one of those migrants may have actually been the one that opened fire in all this. Steve, Stephania, that's right. Investigators tell us that those four believed to be migrants were all men in the age range of 20 to 30, and they were being held here at the Berg's Mill Motel, where they were being held against their will. Now, they were able to escape as well as grabbing a gun from one of their captors. They explained they took off down South Presta running on foot. The suspects then chased them in a black pickup truck. That's when the four men tried to run in zigzags across the, tree, uh, the street to avoid being hit while also taking aim and fire at that truck. But the driver was still able to run over two of those people just up the road by a bar. There was a black Ford that ended up crossing Pressa to hit these young fellows. They just heard the gun swaps and immediately locked the doors and said, the police will handle it. That's the manager of Thirsty's Bar, where all this ended across the street. Police tell us one of the migrants hit by that truck is in critical condition, but the other is expected to be okay. As for the suspect in the black F-150, he is still on the loose. Police are still looking for him. This is still an active investigation. You saw the police lights going by us just a few moments ago. We do not know if that is related, but we'll try to bring you updates as soon as possible. John Paul Barajas, KSAT 12 News.